today's video is regarding hacks and yes this is my first ever hacks video but i hope this video will be useful to all you mummies out there but if you're not a mummy don't worry you must be having a small brother or sister or niece nephew if not that also someday or other this hacks will be useful to you i hope you understand if you are having problem to send your kids every day to school because of their behavior their irritation or they cry every time they don't want to go to school then these hacks can be useful to you not some extraordinary hacks or out of the box kind of but these are something which i do on daily basis and i thought why not share it with you all these hacks can be useful to you if you are you have just recently started sending your kids to play school or basically uh, in simple language i can say and a five year kids you can use this hack so if you want to know what are these hacks then please keep on watching the first and the most important thing which i want to share it with you all but i don't want to include it in the hack is a um, fresh start with mom yes it basically means that we the superheroes that is mummies if we ourselves are very happy and cheerful in the morning while waking up our kid you know that creates a very positiveness in your kids also where is the opposite side if you yourself are very depressed or very irritating or you yourself are feeling that oh god school again and i have to do all these household works and then school and these so that will i won't say that this will impact them totally negatively no i'm not saying that but yeah they will definitely think that uh huh my mom is so upset every day while sending me to school or is there anything wrong going to school yeah why is she so upset every day in the morning so we definitely don't want these things to go on in your child right i completely understand that some days there can be sometimes when we are totally depressed or something wrong is going but still in the morning if uh, i will request you all if you try this and if you smile and you know uh, with your cheerful mood if you wake up your child definitely this is going to impact next thing we all know that kids life is the best time because they get happiness in so small small things and that's what my next point says get them a new toothbrush water bottle tiffin box we all do that but hold on i'm not saying that do it every day bring a new stuff every morning no i'm not saying that but count it logically because uh, as we all know kids toothbrush should be changed every after 3 months it's 3 months but i generally do it every after 2 months for you so what i do is i have always one option one backup as you must you all must also have this and one for traveling so you have two to three toothbrush at least for your kids so what you can do you can shuffle that this is not particularly only for you but i think every child gets happiness in using a new tiffin box or water bottle you can always show them what they are going to take tomorrow in morning in the school with them not only water bottle and tiffin box if you think that this hack can be used in some other thing or item obviously you can do that and uh, you will get very easy for this it's just for example you will get these type of cute little bottles and trust me this is within rupees 100 it's not that expensive and i'm not telling you to you know like spoil your child bring every day very branded stuff for them no i'm not saying uh, that thing but just try to bring some funky things or like you know with bright color something which is having very bright so that it attract my next point My next point is new something that day. It means that in the morning when you are trying to wake up your prince or princess, and that time they are like, no, I don't want to get up or I don't want to go. Or they have started crying. Just give them five minutes and tell them that that day you are going to be you plus your kid. You both are going to do new something that day. It means that you are going to go to a park or a playground, or you can go to their best friend's house or the place where your kids love and. I totally understand that going to play zone or to malls every day is not possible and that's not good also for your kid still there are many places where your child would love to go play around and meet new friends new kids or breathe in fresh air or just roam around run around that will be a lot for your kids so you both sit and discuss and decide your plans for the day and then your kids will also be happy and for sure they are going to cooperate with you next important point is no fake promises this is a big no never ever make fake promises with your kids no if you think that oh she is just two or three or he he cannot understand he is very small uh -huh. you are because if you think only we elders have all the feelings and trust and only our trust breaks and only our heart breaks then you are wrong 
kids will calculate that thing so quickly and then if once their trust is broken they will never ever trust you no matter whatever big promises you make or you fulfill it later on but that time your kids will be totally disappointed and you know parents parents breaking the trust is a very negative thing never ever do that never make promises which you cannot fulfill which you cannot do or which you are not able to do even if there is chances you can try but just tell them i will try my best to do so but i don't promise you this my next point is new hobby or your kids favorite hobby yes now you know what there was a time when we used to take admission in some classes or uh, some sports or anything then it used to be like six days in a week and nowadays it's like just one day in a week or maximum two days in a week i guess so whatever i have heard and i have seen so hopefully that one or two day will help you in sending them to school because you can always cheer them up that after school we are going to play your favorite sport or like football basketball or even if swimming or uh, singing classes music classes nowadays there are so many facilities and you know what Uh, their hobbies will automatically give them all the excitement and happiness and surely they will go to school happy you must be thinking what kind of hacks are these because we want to send our kids every day to school and she's just trying to bribe our kids no i'm not doing that but i just want to say you let's face the truth according to me from this age group from play school to 4 to 5 years it's so difficult the hardest thing is to wake up your kids and in a good mood and we want them to go to school every day again in a good mood and hopefully we know that once the kid is in the class in the school then the teachers and rest kids will automatically divert his mind it's not that he will sit in the class and think only and only about the thing which you have told in the morning no definitely there will be colors playgrounds there will be so many things for diverting their mind and he will be happy and he will be mixed in all the surroundings whatever is happening and then when you are going to take back your child that time maybe he will see you or she will see you and then the thing will be in their mind but other than that don't worry that oh, i have bright my kid or something like that the next and simplest hack is favorite tiffin what is your kid's favorite food just pack it and before keeping it in the bag just show them that i have prepared this for you please do have it properly in your school time and it will again bring a smile on your kid's face so i generally do that with jia my next and the last point is favorite lunch or dinner yes if that day uh, because of some other other reason you are not able to pack the favorite tiffin don't worry just plan up for the favorite food for in lunch or for dinner and i hope you all know what's your kids favorite food so you can prepare it according to that or if you are planning then you can obviously share this with your kids that when you are back from school we are going to have your favorite lunch or your favorite dinner and in a small point here you can also say them that you can have your favorite dish or favorite food in your favorite plate yes i recently got this for jiu and she loved this two bits and i also like this one because this is so cute and it Oh, uh, what do we say? This everything can be replaceable, or it can be. I don't know. I don't have words to explain this. But uh, yeah, and this is not at all expensive. This is also within hundred rupees. Yes, you can find this easily on. uh your market sending kids every day to school is so very important because not only for their attendance but also you know this will create a good manner in them plus they will learn a hell lot of things in the school never ever think that oh school people are very late in their syllabus and everything they can be but other than that you know what meeting new people new friends every day in school and then interacting with them your kid will definitely grow more and more so try to send them school every day other than these hacks there are many basic things i hope you all are maintaining a good time limit or a schedule for your kids because we all know that if you send your kids early to bed then it will help you a lot waking them up early in the morning this will not irritate them because obviously they will have a complete and good sleep so that was all for our today's video i hope this video was useful to you and if it was then please give this video a big thumbs up also subscribe to our channel if you haven't and if you want to leave any comment below or any other hacks then please comment down in the comment section i will meet you in my next video till then take care bye